Welcome to our daily horrors, I'm Economicon, and today I'm playing through the game The Convenience Store, where we play as a girl who has to work the night shift at the convenience store. What could possibly go wrong? It's time. Need to get ready for work. Oh, it's very dark. Okay, there's the light. Perfect. Slept well. Okay, wonderful. I've had a good sleep. I've... Got a rat? Is this normal? Actually, it seems a bit stuffed. That's fine. It's dark outside. Okay, do we have to bring a light, maybe? Right. Okay, get dressed. No. Change clothes. Yes. There we go. Now I'm ready for my long shift at work. Do I need to bring food or anything? Can I, can I eat? Ooh. Do I want to take this with me? Warm it up? Yes. There we go. I have food before I head to work. Nothing creepy out there. That's perfectly fine. Wait. That's the hall, right? To the apartment building. Are you saying someone could stand at my door and watch me sleep? Oh, that's a little creepy, that. Um, how long does my food take to heat up? A long, long time. I might be late to work. Food. Food, can you finish? Thank you. I appreciate you. Eat the bento, yes. I am very hungry. There we go. I've got all my preparations for work. Time to get going. Ow, my face. Close the door behind me. Oh, do we have a communal kitchen then? Go to bring the flashlight. Yes, that's very important. Anyone know where the flashlight is? Is it this? It is! Oh wait, maybe... Wait. Is this... Maybe it's just one of play, isn't it? This is an apartment block, right? Or is this just a house? It would make more sense if it was just a house. Because, I mean... I can't close that. Well, that can stay open. I mean, you could just definitely see... My bed from that door. Okay, now the question is going to be, am I going to manage to get to work without getting hopelessly lost? It's a very important question. I feel like we've got to head toward the lighty area, so that's this way. Ooh, is there a sink here? Nah, this is a bit of shininess. Never mind. Okay, so I'm thinking... Oh, I'm thinking that's what you want right there, right? So in... Oh. Um... This doesn't actually seem to be the stairs. I was misled. I was lied to. Do I get a How do I get down here? Where are the stairs? Um. Excuse me. Your architecture is confusing me. Uh huh. Stairs. There we go. Uh, this is definitely where I want to be, right? Yeah. What could possibly be wrong with me being here? This ain't creepy at all. I'm sure this is a lovely neighbourhood. You know, when it's not uh, 10 to midnight and everything is pitch black. It's fine, we're gonna get there. Um, where was the big light in the convenience store? I did see it earlier. I think it's that way. I'm sure we're gonna get there, no problemo. Yep, this 100% seems like a good way to go. And I never get lost, so you can definitely trust me, right? Well, I'm not hearing any of you. See, I told you all. Anyone that ever doubted me. I did it. I found my job. Okay, so, going to... Oh, hello, buddy. How you, how you doing? You uh, just having a seat here? I know what really happened here. I was called to warn you all by the name I cannot speak of. The day of judgment will come. Ah! Um. Okay, buddy. Leave it to it. Have a nice night now. There we go. Hi, boss. Are you my boss or... Well, either way, I've made it. Aren't you proud of me? Enter the counter, yes. Speak. Oh, good. You made it. Hmm? Oh, no. It's just that I recently heard someone had fell off the bridge you just crossed. 
There was an old lady that said she saw a man walking down the street with his legs completely bent the other way. Scary stuff. If only this was a true story. <laughs> Sorry. Well, okay, buddy. Um, I'm just gonna go in here. Never mind. Uh, this my punch slip. How do I do it? punch in? Yes, I'm definitely getting paid for my job. Thank you. Oh, he's just gone. Well, okay then. Gonna look at this. I think some booze are expired by the time you start your shift. Can you take them off the shelves for me? Your manager. Well, okay, manager. Just hello. Hello? Wait. I, I swear I heard the door. Hello? Is anyone in here? Oh, okay. Is that my... Oh, that's the manager leaving, right? Okay, bye. Bye to you too, buddy. S excuse me. Okay, I was getting really concerned. Anyway, um, anything in here I need to do before that? You know, something else I could look at, right? This? Oh, okay, yeah, you you enter the store, that's no problem. Ooh, you CCTV. Don't mind if I do. I want to be nosy. Okay. There you are, buddy. I see you. Okay. Um, so how long do we think he's going to be? Hey, uh, are you nearly done? Because I've got work to do. Uh, you know what? He's taking his own sweet time. We're going to go do our other job. Okay, what's expired? How do I know if it's expired? That's very dirty. The shelf looks fine. Um, okay. What about ah? You're telling me where to go. Looks like some are expired. Take items off the shelf. Yes, all of them. That's a lot of expired food. What about this? Okay. Do I need to go put this one out first? Where do I dump it? I don't know. Have we got a bin somewhere? Um. Hello, does anyone know where I want to dump the large bag of expired food? I, I would, I would give... Do you want the expired food? I suppose you can have it. Uh, oh, there you go. Enjoy that. Oh, I really hope I didn't just poison him. Oh, what's this? 13 books an hour night shift. This is the reason why I'm here. Oh, anyway. Um, okay. Sorry, I, I would serve you. I'm just having problems with the door. Hi, I hope you've not been waiting too long. I've been very busy. Anyway, what would you like now? Hello, so... Thank you, come again. Have a nice night now. I've got more work to do. Uh, okay, more expired food, yes? I need to check this. Sanku's choice. Hey, I'll give it a try. I, I mean, I was trying to get to check for expired foods, but okay. This shelf looks fine. Ooh, nice croissants. Uh, the shelf looks fine too. And... Some are expired. Okay, take them. Yes. So is, where actually am I supposed to be taking this stuff? Because uh, I don't think I was actually supposed to be taking it to the uh, homeless guy. Aha, there are the bins and... Wait. Wait, what's going on here? Mm, yes. Wait, no, don't do this. I was trying to look at the bin. Oh, okay, it was just the animation, I see. Um... What was this? Should I be concerned about that? I feel a little bit concerned. I'm sure it's fine. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, I'm definitely gonna go back inside now. But okay, time to continue my job. Oh, oh, customer! Customer, I'm here! Uh, hello, customer. Hello? Hello? What are you doing? What are you doing? Manager, the door is broken. Manager, you need to fix this door. Oh, some doors, I tell you. You, yes, use it. Maybe you can tell me what's been going on with this door, huh? Channel 2. This is also channel 2. No, this one's channel three. Oh, uh, oh, that's a big ass lobby. I see. Okay, this the suspicious duck off area. Hmm. 
Everything is looking mighty normal. Well, okay then. There we are. We still have the truck yet. Well, what else is on here? Um, nope, it's still just about the expired food. Okay, haven't I finished that? I thought I got most of it. Have I missed some expired food? Um, don't. Don't even try me right now, door. I'm busy. Uh, yes, yeah, oh. Oh, okay, hi, that's a genuine one. Understood. Hello, buddy. Um, can I do something with the parcel? It's kind of late for delivery, man, at this time, huh? We recently incorporated the system exclusively for convenience stores that are open late at night. Looks like this t package is directly shipped to this store. Oh, and the name matches your tag. Think this is for you. For me? Um, well, okay then. Take it home. I may... I mean, I don't know if I particularly want to, but sure. What's the worst that can happen? Oh! My shift immediately ends. Well, I'm assuming I got all my work done. Wait, didn't I eat you earlier? Ah, there's the package. I had a tape. Well, okay, let's give this a look-see. There it is. Watch closely. Yes. Watch very closely. Wait, is that the area I was concerned about? The one at the back of the store? Hmm. Well, that's concerning. Anyways, my food done? Oh. Was there not food in here? Why were you on? Interesting. Have you have I got more food? I do not. Well that that's unfortunate. Maybe I should just go to bed. No? Is it time for me to go to work? Oh, it's time for me to go to work, that's why. Uh do I need to get changed again? No? I'm already changed? Well okay then, time to go to work. There we go. Do I need my light again? Most likely. It seems very, very dark still. Yes, pick up the flashlight. Okay, nothing for me to be concerned about, right? Just uh Normal kitchen, okay. But there we go. Everything is a okay. First night. Well, okay then. Time for my first night. You know what? Well, I'm very concerned by the fact that my front door stays open. Clearly, if someone was trying to stalk or kill me, they could very easily do so. You know, would you be surprised if I said I may have already forgotten the way I went to get to work last time? No? Yeah, me neither. Oh, I remember this lie, though. It just means it's very, very dark. Seems a lot darker than last night. It's fine, it's fine, we can figure it out. Okay, there's stairs around here, yes? Yes, there in fact was. There we go, down we go. And... Down some more stairs, that's what we want. Hmm. Think it's this way. Okay. Um. Well, it's definitely, definitely a bit uh, creepier than last night. Have I gone the wrong way? I think I may perhaps have gone the wrong way. Uh, it doesn't particularly matter, does it? Nah, nah, it should be fine, I think. But what I can vaguely make out from um, the rough outlines in the very, very darkness. You are very ineffective, just so you know. Oh, there's my shop. Perfect. Hey, my buddy on the outside doesn't seem to be here. Well, okay then. Time to get to work. Hey, manager. Are you going to be proud I've made it to work again? In we go. Thank you. Hello. I'm here. Hey, it's Owen. Hey, hey. So I heard you reported that the doors would open on their own. Yes, they are broken. We really need to think about that. Well, we got a guide to check the sensor and it seems like the wirings were loose. Oh, you thought it was some sort of poltergeist? I see those on TV all the time, but they're all scripted. Ghosts aren't real after all. If you say so, buddy. 
I mean, I also say that, but still. You're saying it, so I don't believe you. Okay, you left? Yeah, you're leaving. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Betty. See you later. I've got work to do, I think. I saw some rats behind the store yesterday. Someone must have left the garbage bin open. The first person to see this note has to get rid of the rodents ASAP. Um, why do I need to get rid of them? Why doesn't the person that wrote the note get rid of them? Me, I'm just saying. Your manager. Ah, that's why. Okay, how, how do I even get rid of rats? I don't know how to kill a rat. I can't even kill a spider. Listen, I like my horrors and I like my monsters. Doesn't mean I like rodents and doesn't mean I like bugs. Um, okay. Uh, so I back. Oh, that looks important. Aha! That's got a cute little mouse on it. So this has got to be mouse killer, right? Where did you say it was? Did you say it was out back? I think so. So maybe by the bins? Ah! I can do this. This is no problemo. Uh, Okay, I know I didn't do that much carnage. Hi, Betty. I need you to die. This is very effective, Rat Killer. You can't hide from me. Well, you're gonna have to wait a minute. I'm very busy killing rats. I'm not stopping this task partway through. Okay. Because it definitely looked like the tape was somewhere around here, right? Uh -huh, I see you. Think you can hide in the shadows? You think you can hide behind the... Is that the aircon? It might be the aircon. Well, you can't either way. There we go. Well, I've killed the rats, so someone else can pick up the garbage. It's not my fault if more rats get summoned because they're all over the floor. Anyway, I think I've got a customer. Maybe I should go wash my hands. I have just been killing rats. Eh, who's gonna know? It's fine. Hi, but uh, Hello? Oh, there you are. Hi, Grandma. Grandma, you okay? You good? Wait, is your, is your neck okay? Is that, is that, wait, excuse me. Is that an injury? Wait, stop it. I'm trying to look at your neck. I can't tell if it's an injury or if it's just wrinkles. I, I'm just gonna hope it's just wrinkles. Terribly sorry, Grandma. I was rather up in your personal space there. Believe it or not, I was doing it for your own good. Okay, well, Grandma's gone to the toilet. Understandable. I'm going to keep a good old watch on my store. Hello? Okay, that's still a carnage mess. That's fine. Hmm. No, nah, everything seems good. Everything seems normal. Well, okay then. Just waiting for you to finish, Grandma. No bush or anything. You take your time. Oh, I'm pretty sure that's not how you park, buddy. I'm pretty sure you need parking. Excuse you can't leave your car like that. Who do you think you are? What do you want? Hey, I'm in a hurry. Now, could you please fetch me? Five cans of beer and a pack of cigars. Well, I mean, if you're in a hurry, you can go fetch them yourself and I'll ring them up for you, buddy. Hurry up. Uh, it's also rude customers. Uh, it's, I, don't, I don't even know. Oh, are these just cigars? You mean cigarettes? Okay, you meant cigarettes. That's fine. Um, Five cans of beer. Might get have to carry these individually. Buddy. Oh, go get it yourself. Thank you. That's exactly what I'm saying. I'm not getting paid to be your slave. Um. Anyone know which one the beers are? Is this beer? I'm gonna assume this is beer. Well, you're gonna have this regardless. If you don't like it, go get it yourself, buddy. Yeah, you want this? I just trick it his head. Well, I can pretend I did, and it makes me feel better. Okay, well. We're gonna take a while, it's fine. Grandma, take your time, it's fine. I'm gonna be here a while just carrying these guys one beacon at a time. It's a douche. <gasps> oh. See, don't you have any six packs of beer? That would have made this so much more convenient for everyone. <laughs> oh, here you go, here's your third one. Okay, it's fine. 
Um, so, you having a fun night? Is uh, is this going fast enough for you? I mean, you said you were in a hurry. Is me slowly walking backwards and forwards, helping? <gasps> okay. You know, Grandma, you've been in there an awful long time. Are you okay? Do you do you need me to call someone for you? Do you need an ambulance? I'm rather concerned, Grandma. Okay, now, buddy. I fetched all your things. Um, you you get you get an extra charge. You get an extra charge for making me work hard. Thank you. Um. You get an extra charge just for parking like an ass. That's what you get. Oh, Grandma, how you doing? You feeling okay? Yeah. Okay. You take your slow walk. I'm gonna keep an eye on you just in case you fall. I'm gonna watch you through the security. Um. Wait. Wait. Where's the Grandma? Wait. What? Grandma? Oh, oh, you're waiting for me at the door. Wait, why were you not on the security camera? Are you okay? You're gonna call if you needed help. Hello. Hugh. Huh? Where's Ken Kun? You know where Ken Kun is. I thought I heard his voice. This was my daughter's house. What did you do? How dare you? Uh, Grandma? Grandma, stop, stop strolling towards me um, aggressively. I, I have no idea what you're talking about. I have not. This ain't a house, Grandma. I feel threatened by the Grandma. She's just, she's slowly, slowly walking towards me menacingly. I'm just going to step away from the door, Grandma. What are you? Um, I think Grandma needs some help. Emma, you get home safe now, right? You're not driving, are you? Everything okay in here? Everything seems okay. I'm gonna assume that's normal. Um, does Grandma get home? Grandma? Okay. Well, the good news is she does not seem to be driving. But you don't have a car, do you? Wait, that's not your car, is it? Grandma, I should—I I, I should tell you—I don't—I don't feel like you should be trusted behind the wheel. She's going to it. She's going to it, Grandma. You're not supposed to be driving. Are you? Wait. Ah, uh, customer, customer. Oh, it's okay. It's fine. Um, we've just got a creepy car that does not belong to. Yes, yes. I'm coming back to the door. I know you're broken. Excuse me. Excuse me, I was doing something very important. I was making sure the grandma wasn't about to go crash her car. Okay, what's going on with the doors now? Someone in here? Hmm. Hmm. Wait, what? You, you kids! I caught you that time, kid. You running back to my door. I'm unentertained by you. Um, is there anything else I need to get done? Oh, maybe I need to go and try and confront that kid. That might be a good idea. Messing around with my door, huh? Wait. Were you the package truck? You, uh, you okay? Hi. You are, you... Okay, I think I need to go wait for him inside. Okay, it's fine. I'm gonna beat him here. Gonna beat him. I need to get behind the counter. Okay, stand here like a professional. There we go. Hello, sir. How are you doing this fine, fine night? You okay? You need something? Good to see you again. Oh, you know, the unstoppable trend on ordering everything online. Anyway, there seems to be a package that needs to be picked up here. I mean, is that? Have I seen a package? Oh, the big one right here. How have I only just seen this? Here you go, buddy. Give the package. Yes. 
Yes. Bye bye now. Have a good night. Should I be concerned about whatever's inside that package? I'm sure it's fine. What's the worst that can happen? Okay. Um, is that all I need to do for the night? I think so. Yeah, that's just him leaving. That's perfectly fine. Now are those kids about to come and mess around with my secured cameras again? Uh, hey, that car's still there. I thought that drove off. Curious. Hmm. Okay, so I don't know where the kids went. Maybe they've stopped playing their games. Then should be fine then. Hmm. Is there anything else I need to get done? I'm not sure. Doesn't seem to be anyone here, that's fine. Uh, oh! Well, okay, second night. Interesting. Nothing to be concerned about, I'm sure. I've still got no food, that is quite unfortunate. Okay, I guess we're going back to work. Yep, I definitely need the umbrella this time. It seems to be raining a lot. And there's my flashlight. Hello? Where's that my front door? Oh! Open it? Sure. Curious. Hmm. Okay, so clearly the creepy tape guy now knows where I live. That's uh, quite unfortunate. Watch closely. Yes. You know, this would probably be more intimidating if I recognised where that was. I do not. I mean, it's probably supposed to be um, my place, right? But uh, I, I don't know that for certain. I can't identify the place, so I'm not going to be concerned. I'm just going to keep my umbrella up and I'm just going to go to work. Probably shouldn't have left the door open, but never mind. Okay. So now we've got the delightful experience of trying to get to work in the freezing rain. I mean, this is actually easier to see tonight. Okay, so that's the, that is the lie. Don't trust those stairs, they don't exist. It's fine. We know where we're going now. We've done it twice before. What could possibly go wrong? Okay. Uh, excuse me, I'm getting stuck on the stairs. Uh, they're going to take a nice right turn. Uh, uh, I think it was this way. Is this the way we went the first night? I can't remember. Well, either way, we'll end up where we need to be, right? Uh, I think. Uh, I think I need to go right. I think I've gone the wrong way. I might have gone the wrong way. I think I did. Look at the, is there anything I can actually find down here? I don't think so. Well, okay. Try and try to get to where we need to be. Can I cut down the alleyways? Is this a good idea? What do I mean? I think it works. Oh, great, it's fine. Um, I should probably stick to direct paths. Anyway, this is where we needed to be. I remember as if I'd only been here ten minutes ago. And now we're going to see our beautiful lights right over here. There we go. I've made it once more. Not even the rain can thwart me. Okay. So... I mean, the good news is, it's raining, so uh, the kids should not be coming around to mess my door, huh? I've arrived. I'm a little bit damp. Manager? D did you say not even wait for me this time? Shame on you, manager. I'm leaving before I got it. Oh! Hi, buddy. How you doing? Having a good night? Playing games? I'm an impressed with you. Boo. I got you good, huh? Okay, okay. Fine, I'll stop. I promise I won't do it again. You know what? I don't believe you. I don't. Not at all. 
Okay, it's fine. Gonna punch in and then we'll go and try and find who's gonna be messing with my door today. Some products were missing on the shelf. Always keep the shelves full. That's our motto. So please restock them by tomorrow morning. Your manager. Well, okay, time to get some restocking done. How hard could it be? Um, so what do we need? We need something for here, right? So that bento box and whatever that is. Well, okay, I can go and just grab some things from the back. Wait, is it raining inside? I could have sworn it was raining. Uh, it certainly sounds like it's raining in here. What do I need then? Uh, this? Okay, we've got crisps. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Which shelf is empty of crisps? Not you. That's not it. Hello? Where's the crisp gap? There it is! Yes! Wonderful, okay, so one done. There's about two or three to go. It's fine, we can do this. We are very good at this. We got don't need those. I need boxes. You are what I need. Okay, so we've got more crispy things. Um Excuse me? Hey, that that is, that is the door to the shop, right? Wait, are you kidding me? What? Um. Excuse me. Am I, am I being robbed? Hello? Wait. Wait, what? Excuse me? What kind of shenanigans are going on here then? I don't even know where these go. Ah. Uh, okay. Spookiness is happening again. We've got a uh, cheeky ghost that thinks they can lock me in. I don't even know where these go. Where are these going? Hi. Don't mind me. I'm just trying to find out where do we stalk these. Mm, no. Is it? Is it meant to be this? Ah, okay. It's meant to be that. Okay. No. I mean, I'm coming, buddy. I just got locked in the back room. It's been a whole situation. Hello, now what would you like? I'm Hamada. So, there's something wrong with the air conditioning? Your boss seemed desperate in keeping the food fresh. Hate to be working this late, but he pays me well, you know? Don't mind me. I'll just quickly check the outside units and head right out. Well, okay, um... See, it's raining in here, I can see it! Anyway, yep, you check those units. I'm gonna quickly check this because shenanigans are going on. Who locked me in? Is that my manager? Did my manager come back just to lock me in? Hmm. Okay. Time to delete. Um. I mean, anyone else see the creepy demon backwards crawl away from the hole? Well, okay then. So, um, I should be restocking. Ah, who am I kidding? Who wants to go and check out the back? You want to go see what Creepy Demon is doing down with the, uh, destroyed, taped off area? I know I want to see that. Dun -dun. Yes, we can actually get out of here this time. Hey, you, you're a very slow walker. I basically beat you here. You doing good? Hello? I saw someone here. Hmm. It's locked. There's a bike here. Interesting. Is there anything else here? No. Okay, so I'm going to have to find a key then. I'm sure we'll find it eventually. And then we'll know to come back. But until that time, I suppose I've got to get some more work done. Everything okay? Oh, is that it? You're done? Okay, I think he's done. Okay, now the last of my restocking. I've done that box, done that box. It is you! Now I know where you guys go. Haha, <laughs> I've not been locked in this time. 
I will not be contained. Thank you very much. And I can go here. Beautiful. I think that's my restock and done. I don't think there is that like individual one. Uh, hello. Aha, uh -huh. and my next customer's arrived. One second. Okay, I'm here, I'm ready. Hello. Bye bye. Oh, I'm gonna go watch on the CCTV. Why not? Watcher. Wait, I don't see her. Oh, there she is. It's nice to know you show up. I don't remember seeing Granny. Okay. You good? You having fun? Got a lot of selection there, I see. Okay, that's all done. I'll just stand patiently and wait for my customer to get here. Everything else is done. You know, it's got to be nice having literally one task a night. Maybe I should go find this night shift. Okay, take this, gonna scan this. Have a pleasant evening. Hey, are you the only one working here? I can't believe this. What kind of manager puts a girl on a midnight shift alone? I see you have no choice. Well, at the very least, I'll give you my protection charm. Now be careful. Oh, thank you. Sure, I'll take it. Why not? Much appreciate you. Hmm, don't think there's anything else for me to be doing, right? I have done my restocking for the day. It was a very laborious task, I'll have you know. Hmm, everything looks pretty normal. Well, okay then. Hmm. Um, so is there anything else that I need to do, I wonder? Don't think there's any more packages here. So I doubt the delivery driver's going to get here again. Hmm. And yeah, you just just say restock, right? Yeah, it was just restocking. That is done. Because I am very efficient, I'll have you know. Hmm. We can go explore, I suppose. Why not? Hello. Nope, it's still wet. I'm staying inside, thank you very much. Uh. Well, that's normal. Um, I will leave the spooky ghost to the toiletry, I think. Yep, nothing for me to be concerned about. Let's just get back on CCTV. Clearly nothing's going to happen from behind a camera, right? Right, uh, everyone okay? Yeah. Oh, I'm going to have to go have a look, aren't I? Okay, I'll go look. I'll go look at the creepy toilet. Ah, manager. Manager, you really now need to get this toilet replaced. It's doing funky things. Are you good? Listen, buddy, are you okay? Um, well, that's a bit of an issue. Uh, I, I really don't need the toilet. I can, I can get that to work, you know. Um, excuse me? Are you kidding me? Excuse me, creepy demon, you are cleaning this up. Wait. Um, get off my computer. Excuse me. Uh, pardon me, what are you doing on my computer? I love you, no demon. Um, excuse me, get back here and clean up this mess. Excuse me, where did you go? Uh, no, you need to come here and you need to clean up your shenanigans, woman. Just because you're deceased does not mean you'll get to make a mess. And it also especially does not mean that I have to clean it up. Um, oh, this isn't even products, it's talisman. Wait, think of talismans. Okay. Well, I mean, I'm going to have to clean everything anyway. Disgraceful demon. Hmm. Am I gonna have to clean this as well? What do I do with the talisman? Do I need to go put it in the bin or something? Um. I mean, I'm not entirely sure what else to do with it. 
Okay, I'm gonna go and put this somewhere. Is the demon gonna get upset if I put it in the bin? Most likely, right? Would you like this? Oh, I'm not even able to. Hmm. I, I'm not entirely sure who wants the talisman then. Oh, maybe that's what wants it. Maybe that's the TV, isn't it? Hello? Would anyone like some talismans? Wait. Uh, exercise the door? Okay. Okay. Um, clearly that's what I'm supposed to be the talismans. I'm a genius. Okay. Demon be gone. You are being exercised away from your creepy dwelling. Also, while you're exercising away, please come and clean up your mess. Oh, I'm going to have to clean it up, aren't I? A shame on you, demon. You know what? I'm not even given the option to clean it, so clearly... You know what? It's not my problem. Not my responsibility. Nope. Anything else I need? Is this... Okay, it's still broken. Hmm... Okay, I don't know if there's anything else I need. Is there anything else I can do? I'm not entirely sure, because I don't think there's anything I could do outside, was there? I picked up the talismans, I've excised the door. Is there somewhere else I need to go? Or am I just waiting for the next event to trigger? Hello? Is there anybody here? I'm not seeing anyone. Uh, uh, was that sick? I was not supposed to do it out back. I mean, like, I physically cannot pick this stuff up, right? No, none of it. Uh, I don't think there's anything left in here for me to do, was there? Yeah, you're working normally again? Spectacular. Hmm. Yeah, you're the broken camera now, aren't you? Quite inconvenient. Hmm, was there anything else I needed to do then? Doesn't seem to be anything else back here. Was there something that I needed? Oh, wait, that! Oh, he dropped his wrench. Oh, open AC? Why not? What's the worst that can happen? Oh, is it? I thought he was just here to fix it. Oh, we found the key. Wow, well, we all know what we need to do now. I need to get inside the door. Ow. Wait. Wait, is that manager? Manager? Um, wait, right, four? I, I can't leave again. Hello? Uh, you can bang on the door you want, I can't do anything. There's absolutely nothing I can interact with. Manager, wake up! Uh, I take it back, don't wake up. Are you okay? You seem to be missing your eyeballs. Uh, am I gonna die here now, manager? I mean, what's the whole fall about? Can you explain it to me? Third night. Well, clearly that was nothing but a fever dream, right? Uh, another tape? Interesting. Watch closely? But of course! Wait, that's where we just found the manager, isn't it? The one we excised the door of. Do I need to go back there? Hmm, interesting. What a nightmare. Was it all a dream? 
I have no idea. Well, time to get to work. Was the well, well, no. If our manager is there with no eyes, then we'll know it wasn't precisely a dream now. Okay, time to go to work. Good news is, the vein has stopped. So now we just need to get back there. And clearly we need to go reinvestigate our uh, creepy little back room kind of place, right? Hmm, I'm sure it's going to be fine. I mean, we have also got our demon friend that likes to show up. Uh, stairs are here. There we go. See, I remember perfectly. Now, down here. I mean, it also is very convenient that, uh, the convenience store is very, very bright. It makes it very obvious where I'm supposed to be going to. Uh, not that one. I need to keep going. Yeah, we'll be there soon enough, I'm sure. Okay, so my turn off was this one. There we go. You know, if I was going to be attacked in the dark, this would be the perfect time to do it. All oh, these driveways are so pitch black. Okay, there we go. I'm sure this is going to be just another normal shift. Nothing going wrong, no spookiness happening, no demons breaking my cameras. Yeah, it's all going to be fine. There we go. Manager? Manager, you're dead. Um, my time slip is not even here. Huh. Well, okay, guess we're gonna go check on our back house. Uh... Well, this wasn't how I remembered it. Everyone okay? Why's where all the teeth? Wait, turn it on. Sure. Uh, am I supposed to be doing something with the TVs? Seems to be. Do I just need to turn them all on? No? Huh? Okay. Can I go anywhere? Okay, so what's going on with his TVs? Hmm, so I'm guessing it's only going to be certain ones I've got to turn on, right? Uh, okay, that's locked. I wonder where you can find out which TVs it should be. There doesn't seem to be anything back here. Okay, so is there anything here? Um, they all look the same. I wonder if one of them just like has a different colour light or something? Sure. No. Okay, so wait. You? You don't have any sound. So are you correct? So am I only looking for the ones with no sound? Okay, so maybe I am. So is it then just trial and error until you find all the ones with no sound? It might be. Okay, wait. That one's got no sound. Is that correct? Maybe. Um. Now it's going. Now it's got sound. Wait, it's not turning off though. Huh. Maybe I'm wrong. Hey. Okay, I'm gonna have a mess around with these TVs for a minute and see if I can figure out how this works, and I'll get back to you. Okay, so wait, on the CCTV, there's a creepy ghost. So I looked up at that one. Okay. Mm Looks down there. Okay, so 
Put it down the center aisle and I think that's down. Okay, coming down again. I can okay wait, I can see you there. I think that's a straight ahead. Okay, you're gonna just repeat it now. So I'm guessing that we've gotta turn on the screens that the kid stops to look at. Okay, let's see if we can get these screens correct. Okay, so it uh, it was maybe maybe it was that one. It definitely wasn't that one though. Okay, man, this is gonna be a lot of trial and error to try and get these screens correct. So I'll jump you through when I get it. No. Is that not it? Wait, did I get it? Okay, I think I did it. Hello? Oh, there you are! You're the one that's been messing around. Hi, demon. I wasn't touching the kid. Um... Okay, everything's back to normal. That's that swell. Okay. Oh, okay. Hello? Is that an actual coach or is that a demon again? Oh, I think it's just someone messing around again. Oh. Bring home. I'm going to regret this, but why not? The fourth night. Okay. Uh, wait, what's this? Throw away. I'll do that next time. Oh. Send it to someone else? Or we could watch it. I'm really curious. I really want to watch it. I want to know what it is. Yes. Are you sure? No, but do it anyway. Okay, that I recognize. Um, how'd you get onto my balcony? When I'm clearly sleeping. Was I kidnapped with a demon? Oh, it looks like I'm about to be. I can't move. I think... Oh, no. I can do nothing to prevent this. Demon, did you follow me home from the convenience store? Listen, I turned the TVs on for the kid. I... I can't move. Yeah, it's a bit of an issue, isn't it? We might die here. We might get abducted. I can't even tilt my head. Oh no, it's bad. Am I gonna sleep well? Is this a sink? Oh, hello there. You were saying to have gone in my apartment already. I think I died. Yep, I'm dead. <laughs> and now we've all learnt our lesson. When you find a haunted videotape, just send it on to someone else to deal with. Okay, it's fine. Well, we'll go get the other ending now. We'll just send this tape on to someone else. Okay, we're back. And this time, I think, yeah, we should send it off. Hey, it could be someone else's problem. Are you sure? Absolutely. Not my issue. I was sickened by the whole situation. I sealed the VHS tape carefully and decided to send it off to the sender. Fortunately, the sender's address was on the box. When I was done preparing to send it off, I felt my tense shoulders relax. Too much had happened in a short span. My mind couldn't keep up. I knew I had to rest, but I couldn't fall asleep. 
Everything about the store terrified me. Inevitably, I had to sit down on a chair to clear my head. What did I see? Was everything I witnessed even real? Although I was scared, I knew I had to know the truth. I wanted to know what had happened and why. So I turned to the internet about the store. I found a few old articles and forums talking about the location of where the building was made. One comment on a strange forum stood out to me. It said, There seemed to have been gruesome killings at the property. I searched the same user's comments. In 2009, there was a case where a man who was mainly stay of the family committed a murder-suicide. I determined to investigate the incident further. September 14th. The man killed his child with a kitchen knife while his wife was off to do a grocery shopping to the local supermarket. When the wife came back, it said that she was killed in an extreme way. He then hung himself on the same day. They say that the woman was pregnant at the time of her death. The woman was killed with several nails punctured onto her lung with her child in her stomach. I wanted to throw up from the obscene image, but I knew I had to continue. There was a guy that replied to the comment and said that he had worked at the same place as him. According to him, the man was often harassed by his boss at work and he had complained to several colleagues and on the day of the incident, he said that he had an emotionless face. Imagining what the family had gone through, depression and hatred occupied my head. It was very painful. With my tears in my eyes, I closed the internet gently and called the manager to talk about everything I had experienced during the night shift and what I had discovered. However, the calls were never picked up. It was the same over and over again that I received a phone call from Mr. Jose, a franchise leader who I had never met. I had a bad feeling about it. Then, with a shivering voice, he said, The manager is dead. I couldn't breathe. So it wasn't a dream. And when I asked about the place where it was found, Mr. Jose said that there was an old storage behind the convenience store, and he was found there after a day of his death. I dropped my phone. I quit my part-time job with a broken feeling. After quitting, I would avoid going near the convenience store whenever I could, because every time I passed in front of the store, I would always feel a sharp stare towards me, and I wouldn't be able to help but try and pass as quickly as possible so as not to look at the building. A day later, the store had closed down. The reason seemed to be due to poor management, but further details were not publicized. At that point, I didn't have the means or the courage to examine it anymore. After a while, the memories of the convenience store started to haze down a bit. One day, as I passed by the now closed down store, I heard a child's voice. There, I saw the woman. When I looked in my hand, I had picked up one of the rusty nails that had fallen in the middle of the site. Okay, so yeah, it's being haunted by the woman that died then, right? I wonder if the husband just like, had a psychotic break then if he was being harassed at work. And now, clearly, she's attempting to kill anyone else. I wonder how the tapes fit into it, then. Maybe it's kind of like a ring effect. You watch the tapes, you die. Well, I hope you enjoyed that play for the convenience store. And the way I see it, if we haven't you learned yet not to watch any creepy tapes we find, and Ringo wasn't enough of a deterrence, then we kind of deserve what we got, do we not? As always, if you want to check out the game, I'll leave the link in the description below. If you enjoyed your time here, then please don't like the video and subscribe to this channel. But other than that, it was a spooky day and I'll catch you next time, guys.